Hi, Mystics. I'm here today to talk to you a little bit about how to develop your intuition and how to strengthen and deepen your intuition and your psychic abilities in some fun and simple easy activities and games that you can play throughout your daily life. We talk a lot about in-depth meditations and energy work and mindfulness and all of these ways that you can work on developing and deepening your natural born gifts, but there are also some fun things that you can do throughout your daily life that are effective and helpful. One of my favorite things to do is to allow my intuition to guide me on a road trip. So this is a no destination, no goal in sight, open-ended road trip, obviously to be done in a safe location and only to be done to the extent that you are comfortable. What you do is simply allow your intuition to tell you what way to go. You have no destination in mind. You set out with an open mind, with flexibility, and each time that you need to make a decision, starting with when you pull out of your driveway or out of your parking spot, you use your intuition to lead you. There are a couple of different ways you can do this. You can simply look in each direction and see what direction looks the most vibrant to you, which one seems to be calling you, which one has the more vivid colors. You can also determine how you feel about each direction, briefly feel it out. You can also see if any messages or images come to you when you consider each direction. But with this game, you want to make these decisions based upon your first feeling. This is a way to really practice going with the flow as far as your intuition is concerned. Go with your first feeling, allow yourself to make the decision based on what you feel in the moment. I have done this many times, I'll continue to do this. My husband and I did this and we came upon a beautiful botanical garden and peacock sanctuary with goldfish ponds and exotic plants that we didn't know existed and a place that we had wanted to find previously. Let me preface that. We didn't know this specific place existed, but I had said that I wanted to find a botanical garden with animals and flowers. We decided to get in the car and take this intuitive road trip. I was leading the reins and I led us to one that we didn't know existed. So these are the kinds of things that, you, that can happen when you go with the flow, use your intuition and play a fun game. I challenge you to try this for yourself and see how it turns out. Be safe, don't get too lost. If you start to get uncomfortable, then you'll stop the game. I'm sure everyone has the phone in order to use your GPS and find your way back home. You can also do this with walking. So this is, this is not when you're in an unfamiliar place. This is more like when you're in a place that you already are familiar with or when you're in your own neighborhood. But use your intuition to make your decisions about where you're going, which way you're turning, which direction you're going. See where it leads you. You might find something that you haven't found before. You might be led to some hidden gem that you never knew about in your own area but also what you're doing mostly is really learning to go with the flow with your intuition, learning how it works and learning to use it and learning to build up that instinct, that reaction to go with your gut feeling or to go with your gut thought or to really hone in on how your intuition works for you visually. As I was mentioning before many times, the direction that is the best direction for you is going to look more vivid, more vibrant, brighter, lighter. Uh, it will have a different quality about the colors, a different quality in the air. It's these kinds of things that you'll get to know and to understand and learn to recognize through playing games like this. Some other things that you can do are really brief um, and they're kind of a way to test how strong your intuition is as well as to build up the strength of your intuition. One thing is when you have a day off, when you do not need to set an alarm, try setting your alarm mentally. 
in your mind, tell yourself that you will wake up at a certain time and challenge yourself and see if you do it. There have been studies, there are strong links be between your ability to do such things and your ability to tune into your intuition. Playing these kinds of games with your subconscious mind can be a really powerful way to deepen and strengthen your intuition. Another thing that you can do is to play little games with yourself, keep a journal or a notebook, and make guesses about simple things like what color of shirt your neighbor is going to wear today, what color of shirt your coworker is going to wear, um, what time of day your mother is going to call. Simple everyday occurrences, take a guess at those, tune into your intuition, see what comes to you first right away, Take a guess, write it down, test yourself, and see if you can build your strength or you can see patterns in this over time. When somebody calls you on the phone, don't look at it if you can. If, if it's not in a place where you can see who's calling, don't turn it over. Put your hand on the phone first and tune into it and guess who is calling you before you turn your phone over. See how strongly you're connected. See what comes to you through your feelings. See what comes to you through your thoughts. See if you can get better at that or you may surprise yourself and already be really good at it. So this is a way of getting to know how strong your psychic abilities and how strong your intuition is already. One last thing is a very simple game that you can play with an ordinary deck of playing cards. Go ahead and shuffle that deck, lay them out flat on a surface, on a table or a desk, and then hold your hand over an individual card and see if you can guess something about it. See if you can visualize it or perhaps you can pick up on the energy of it through your emotional body or your physical energy. See what you can pick up about the card before turning it over. Maybe you can guess its color or guess its suit or guess its number or all of the above. This is an excellent way to begin to test and strengthen your intuition and your psychic abilities. So have fun with this. Please enjoy. Be blessed. Be well. Thank you.